All right, we're keeping it low key, keeping it fresh, keeping it like. This is the most boring introduction you've ever done. Yeah, I know. Oh. I wanted it I'll, to I'll, be I'll, like. I'll, I'll spice it up. You ready? Yeah, I wanted it to be like one of those. Yeehaw! Good, good day, old chap. Mario. All right, and uh, I wanted it Got to be like, us, yeah. like just a Sunday morning. Yeah. Walking through Jap Japanese fish market. Wednesday, Thursday. It's Thursday. For us? Yeah. Yeah. Just walking for Japanese fish market. Mm -hmm. You know one of the ones with like loads of stalls? Yeah, yeah. With too much fish. And you're like, you got any of them fish that kill you? And they go, there's a full loads. row. There's <laughs> a full row <laughs> of puffer fish. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, go see, go see uh, John the Puff. Do you know what they might have? No. Some squids. Might have them. So... Do you know what that means? Tying that in. It's going to be a, a so bit of a, a low-key walk along the... Chinese, Japanese, whatever, fish market. Um, <laughs> but people, audio listeners, don't know what you just did there. Neither do I, and I was sat right next to you. <laughs> so, um, so, yeah, so what we're going to do is we're just going to have a quick quick one, because I've got to dash off, and I've got three shows this weekend. Mm. You've not. I don't really got anything to do, but I don't know what to use. Oh, no, you've got to go see the like Afghan troops or something. Yeah, yeah, I'm doing a Shakespeare for the troops <laughs> in Afghanistan. Inside joke. I really want to see Othello. Right, so, um, yeah, so so we're just going to do a quick review of yeah. uh, Splatoon, put that out. And, uh, yeah, it's like initial impressions, because there's, there's parts of the game that I haven't yet played and stuff, but I just wanted to give a, an initial kind of review. Before I started as well, I wanted to say um, it's been great playing with everyone. Um, all our kind of community, our splatoonity. Um, it sounds like a like mortuary thing. Why? I just want to say it's been no. great. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't but say I'm just it like announcing that. <laughs> my death. You ready? I'm the Undertaker. Dong dong <laughs> dong 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 dong. Um, I'm just what little fat Paul Bearer. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, no, it's been cool. I, I, I've played with, I think, everyone that's added me at some point. I, if I ain't yet played with you, I'll, I'll try and kind of get on and... Because and you've only got ass. hours left to live. Yeah, I've only got hours left to live. Yeah, <laughs> yeah and, but then you'll bring me back. I will. Yeah. I will. Yeah, but then I'll cheat on you and go with... Uh, didn't you go with uh, Mankind for a bit? Yeah, yeah. God knows what goes on in that programme. Um <gasps> Big news. I thought he was going to be like, <gasps> it is not a program, it is a sport. <laughs> Big news. Go on. Two days ago, uh -huh. I watched the Scooby-Doo WrestleMania one. Oh, John, John Cena. Cena. What's it like? Really good, actually. Is There's it? only one like, plot twist one. Like, but it was, it was good. It was good. I, I legit think it was, was good. Paul Bearer in it? No, but Sergeant Slaughter's in it. Really? Yeah. And it, was, it, was, it was actually, check it out, it's now on Amazon Prime. UK, check that out. That yeah, was good. Do that. I I'm also sure watched the Frankenstein one. Not so good. No, no. I was like the Jekyll and Hyde episode of Looney Tunes. You know, where Tweety takes that little push and then he goes like into that massive monster. Yeah, 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 cool. yeah. That happens a few times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It happens on Bugs Bunny as well, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Um. So yeah, uh, yes, yeah, Platoon. Anyway, yeah, I, I, I kind of wanted to give an initial impression. Then, especially now the um, their first piece of free DLC has come out. Um. Which has been, it's been really interesting. It's my my initial impression. Well, you normally ask questions, don't you? Yeah. So what what's your questions? Question me, quiz me. Do you have haddock? No. All right. Um, is it good? You like it? No. <laughs> yeah, I, I love right. it. It's so great. so my experience with it was the E three build from last year. And that's a pretty accurate. Is it? Yeah. Yeah. Is that thingy on there? That map. That's that's like the first map. Yeah. Oh right, okay. It's the um, I played the first map a year yeah, ago. Yeah, which is the uh, I think it might be the mall one, the one with that cage where you can like squid through the cage and then yeah. you got yeah. Okay, so um, is shall I ask a big question first? I'll leave it to the end. Good. good. No, build, no, no, build, 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 build it to the it. end. Build it to the end. All right then. So, um, is there enough in it? That was my that, this see this is my first sort of slight criticism, but then at the same time I don't know because it's it's weird the free DLC thing I think is very clever. It's very similar to the Mario Kart. So what do you um, get in the free DLC? You got the Zapper gun and some and the pot macro. So I mean haddock with his macro. Um, yeah, you get that, but it's similar to the Mario Kart thing. Although my 
thing was with Mario Kart is they gave you a lot of content initially and then gave you a lot of content again. Um, Whereas there's not a lot of content. No, not Ma- map not wise, there's not. Is no, it? there's only five maps, which in some ways is kind of good because you really do get to learn those maps like really well. And you're like, as soon as I go on a map, I've got different methods for each one. So like, there's one that's kind of shaped a bit like a robot, like it's got like a square head at the top. And I'm like, right, if I can paint the robot's head, then I've got a good amount of the map. Do you think so, this is them going right? This is a Splatoon platform. Yeah, I think it is. It's, it's like a TV for show. For the next isn't it? two years, we're going to be rolling. We're going to add in, yeah, be adding stuff. Yeah, I think that there's going to be loads of I think loads of Splatoon announcements at E3. Yeah, I I, I wish I'd have predicted that actually in our E3 predictions because I think we will see a lot of that. I I want to see. Oh, gone. A quick addendum. Okay, is that the right word? Mm-hmm. Fucking nailed it. Um, you know there was one where last week where we said. What the hell does he mean about rebranding of Nintendo Land? Yeah. He emailed us to let us know. Anton, which I must have pronounced it Antoine, because at the end he spells it phonetically. Antoine. So Antoine (laughs) says, um, In regards to your recent podcast in which you read my E3 predictions, I feel there will be a rebranding of the Nintendo Land IP soon for several reasons. One, the digital download version has been removed from the eShop and can no longer be purchased digitally. That's true. Two, Nintendo is looking for that amiibo in them things, um, games, in which you can scan a character and unlock content based on that character. Mm-hmm. What better than a Disney Infinity game, Disney Infinity Light game, mm-hmm. that is designed like a theme pack in which buying an amiibo unlocks a mini game within that ties into oh. the characters respective of the game series. It will be a free to play app you download to the eShop and mini games get added by scanning and accompanying amiibo. Mm. I just had a thought with that. What? What if it's a theme park and all the rides are there, but to get on the ride, which is the game, you have to scan the amiibo in? Yeah. That'd be cool. Three. Although, if it was Alton Towers, it wouldn't be. No. Three. Nintendo recently struck that deal with Universal Studios to have a theme park attraction. The download version of Nintendo Land was removed from the eShop roughly around that time. It's possible that Nintendo wants to build hype behind a rebranded Amiibo compatible mm. Nintendo Land to coincide with the reveal and opening of the actual theme park within U- Universal Studios. It would be cool. Enjoy the show. Take care. And Antoine, i.e. Anton. Yeah. It would be cool if it was like... Do you remember that Connect Disneyland Paris game? Where you could walk around Disneyland Paris and interact. That wasn't a yeah, bad game, I forgot actually. That even that came out. A bad game. I never played it, but I remember it. it, was it all I remember right. the adverts on telly. And you it went like, up to like a ride. Like magical. And then you'd be like, oh, it's, you know, um, I don't know, the minecart ride. And then you'd be a mini game. Mm. So that would be cool if it looked like the Universal Studios thing and, and had that. Although, my only thing is, it might be a bit early for that because we don't know what they're doing yet with it. But that is quite a cool idea. I'm. I'm I'm behind that. I'm down with that. Yeah, I'm down with that. Although, I, I do think it'd be another year before they release something. I like, like that, that he got um, quite sneaky and granular, yeah, like I did with yeah, mine. Yeah. I, I emailed him back and said, that makes sense because it makes no sense. Nobody expected them to rebrand Wii Sports, but they did. Yeah. It's Nintendo, anything can happen. I do like that you got all granular and sneaky on your predictions, like I did with the developers. We should totally write an E3 prediction strategy guide for Prima. Yeah. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah. yeah, it went specific, which is good. Um, yeah, uh, but yeah, so back to Splatoon anyway. Another small addendum. Go on. I've been collecting crap to, to give away. Okay. So far, I've got a download code for the Super Mario The Lost Levels. Have you? For 3DS. Okay. Yeah, because I, that's my favourite. All right. I love that. Everyone hates that game, but I actually do like it. I do, yeah. and like Not like even just being... Yeah, kitsch. Yeah, <laughs> I actually do love that game. Um, they can have an original Awata drawing that I've drawn. Yeah, which is quite nice. Yeah, a nice Bristol board and all that crap, and some other stuff as well. Yeah, I've got I've got a couple of things. But just just saying that we are we are collecting thinking, yeah, stuff. We're thinking of you, winner. Um, yeah. So so Splatoon. We were saying about kind of can I um, that as well? announcing things bit by bit. Um, I think that kind of works in a lot of ways. In that, like, as soon as that new map came out. I noticed that like everyone went online to play it. Like, so is the enough people playing? 
Oh yeah, definitely. Okay. You can. You You're can never get... waiting like half an hour. No, I, the longest I've waited is five minutes, and I've been in, and that's only been because it's tried to connect to a game, and then the connection's failed, and then it's gone to the next game or whatever. Because what I've um, been able to see from the um, just just being a person on the internet yeah. is that everyone who's got the game's really passionate about the game. They're playing yeah. it a lot. Yeah, I, I've I haven't been able to get off it. It's, it's weird. It's got like a a really odd way of hooking you and because i think it's because it's three minute matches so it does have that feeling of well one more match it's three minutes right so here's a problem which i already know the answer to but i'm going to okay. ask as if i don't know the problem i've been really wondering and wanting an answer to the Go question on, yeah, yeah. um you look like you wouldn't know the answer i've not got the foggiest no um if i wanted to if me and you were on a wii u yeah which happens from time it does, to time yeah it does it does from time could me and you go onto a onto a, like a lobby and go right? Me and him against the world, not against the world, but me and you in the same no. team, whatever. No. So two people on the same Wii U cannot play in the same match, no. which is a, a problem for me because Nintendo are always like, "Hey, get your buddies round, lean on them like you're a cool kid, yeah. point at the camera like a wicked old witch," and uh, <laughs> <laughs> they're always saying that. Yeah. Every press release, they're in a press release gone by where they've not mentioned a wicked old witch, yeah. and um, kind of and Splatoon's a game for that as well. Witches, yeah. No, for getting people in the same oh, room. Oh, sorry. So, kind of making that an issue. They've is got the dojo where you can kind of go to player and stuff. But I, tr I tried connecting with um, with my girlfriend Annie. We tried playing it like because we were coming up with tactics and stuff, and I was like, right. You can be a sniper if you want, and I'll kind of go in there and, like, do you know what I mean? Like, we'll just come up with tactics, and then we went to play it, and I was like, oh, you can only go on it one player. And I was like, well, that sucks a little bit. I understand why they've done that, though, because if they've not got any communication... No, yeah, that's cool. I've got another question that I don't know the answer to, but I'm going to pretend I do know the All answer right, go. to. Yeah. I already know the answer to this question. Do you? You look like you know. But could I, on my Wii U, yeah. in the same house or a different house... Okay. Go and play a match with you on your Wii U, and it's can you can yeah. you? Yeah, you got any friends list? What and you can add them to to a normal match? Yeah, yeah. Oh, can you? So what happens is you you will kind so of. So you can do that then. You might be playing a match, right? And then I can go. Oh look, my um, my best buddy's available. Mm. Uh, I click on you, and then the next match, the next match you play, like because they just go one on into the next the next one. I'll then be in that one. Uh, so could could you do that with multiple people? Yeah, I I don't know actually. I, I assume. Wait, so. how many how many people are on, well, a, are on a match? Is it like six eight, versus eight, six? eight people? Eight versus so eight. So it's four and four. Six, uh, four and four. So could you do that? Could you populate the list with eight people? Probably. And just yeah. have a little mama Probably. Jump? Yeah, I suppose if you was then it would have to be like a weird chain of like you linking onto theirs, who's linking onto someone else, who's linking. So there's no so e easy way do. to organize like an online orgy. I've not tried. I've not tried to, okay. but I, I think that that would be the way. You'd have to just connect with your friend who's connected to a friend, kind of thing. Um, but I don't know. I've I've not tried to because the thing is, is you can never really find more than one or two people on. So uh, if if I could get no, but I mean, if I once, if I called you up and was like, right, Barry, John, Roger, Dinkley man, well, why am I said, Frank? I'm running out of names. Yeah, Benjamin. me, you, Omar. Benjamin. And old Craggles. Yeah, yeah. We're all gonna... Do you want it? Can you yeah. do that? Yeah, probably, yeah. You could probably work out a way of doing it, yeah. Um, but it's been a real lot of fun to play. Um, I think it's it's really fast-paced, which I like. Mm. It's kind of got the... Um, it's got that Nintendo feel to it. You know, like, like everything... Like, even when you, like, get killed or whatever, it's like, oh, God. You know, like, it's not got that, like... I mean, some people get really angry on it, but I've not really experienced that as much. I'm kind of a bit more like, when a game, when I lose a game, I'm not like, nah, I don't know, like people get on like Call of Duty and stuff. I'm more like, oh. <laughs> if you know what I mean. But it, it kind of is really fun, really hard. I love the art style as well. It's got a really unique kind of look to it, which I kind of really like. It reminds me of um, Brapper the Rapper. Brapper the rapper. the rapper. What's his Parappa. name? Oh, Parappa the rapper. <laughs> Brapper the rapper. It reminds me of him. Mm. Parappa the rapper. Um, 
a little bit. But yeah, it's 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 good. It's, it's it was good. like made of paper though. Yeah, the weapons are are some of them are useless, completely useless. Like I tried snipering for a bit, and I just couldn't get my. I I just didn't like it because because the the maps are so small and there's no real ways to hide. If you want to be a sniper, then you might get a couple of shots in before they're like, oh, he's there. Mm. Do you know what I mean? So, and then once they get near you with the sniper rifle, you've just got no defense. Like, have you, you found solid. any crazy ninjas yet? Is there some people on it that are just um, ridiculous? Like I don't know. Always? See, it's weird because I think because everyone kind of got it at the same time, and we've all kind of leveled up together. Like everyone's around. Everyone no, but got on that day. there's some like Asperger's knobheads who are like they'll just be playing it twelve hours a day. <laughs> there is, yeah, you do see some people who are like who are like but, level twenty or on like you know level wait, wait, twenty wait. on like so, two days. You in. know, I can bring up a uh, Dinkley man and yeah. all that and arrange it. Could we essentially have us four against a team of four random people? Yeah, probably. Uh, or does no, because it, it randomizes who's in what team. All right, so you can't really. Well, that's pretty cool. That is quite cool, yeah. So, so like, you can't just be a team just going and dominating. It's, like, no, usually... Yeah. It's usually yeah. fairly um, spread out. Yeah. Which so, like, there might be someone who's playing their first game and someone yeah. who's, who's Asperger's... Yeah. Asperger's not good. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it does that quite nicely because I think if four people were on and they were Skyping, you Can wouldn't just stand say, a chance. Not all Asperger's people are nobody. no. no. Just, just most this of them. specific person. <laughs> um, yeah, it it would it would be unfair, wouldn't it, if if four people could talk to each other, but the other four can't. Like the communication mm. on something like that can give you a massive advantage. So that's good. I also like the character <laughs> creation. Aspie prick at twelve o'clock like that. <laughs> yeah, 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 and that's his his Wii U name. Mm. Um, yeah, I think that the um, the the character kind of where you can modify your character and stuff's pretty good. I like that. I think that's what we're going to see announcement at E3. I think we're going to see stuff like Mario Hearts. And, oh, yeah. They're going to go I mean? wild with that. I, think, I won't be and surprised I think should. if they'll do... You know, like, Woolly World, where you can scan in your Amoeba and you that's get, like, a That's what I want them to do. Yeah, that's what I want them to do. A Yoshi outfit. Or... Yeah. I, I was saying, like, as soon as I got <sighs> it... How cool would Mega Man be? I know. Well, they've... Have you, there's some fan art that um, Splatoon retweeted the other day that was... I can't, it was called Linkling. Which was someone had done Link mm. as an inkling, and that looked really cool. It looked really, really cool. Um, I missed out on the wave of fan art for SEO. Yeah, <laughs> but yeah, the um, the weapons the weapons are kind of a weird mix between sniper rifles that are awful, and then the splat roller, which is you know that big yeah, roller. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is a pretty good weapon. That's the kind of safe option. Somewhat positive. Right. Um, like I say, children's TV is often on in my living room because yeah, yeah. of Layla. And it's advertised loads. Yeah, yeah, I've seen the advert loads of times, yeah. just like on TV and stuff. Very blue. Yeah. It's good, it's good, and I think it is... It seems like an ideal game for, for them kids that kind of... You know when parents want their kids to be safe online and be playing these safe games, That's but the, the kids thing. want I mean, to be like, playing online like you shooters? Was, we were only on about... Was we on it about like, here on the Secret Santa about that like, gamer rape thing? Yeah, Secret Santa. Was that a Secret Santa? It was a Secret Santa. What? Get on the Cooper Club. What's that? Uh, it's the Cooper Club um, special podcast that we do for those people who pay five dollars and up a month. Oh, that sounds good. It's good. It's I'll, I'll got that. I'll, I'll, where, where, where do I sign up? Uh, go on Nintendo Sushi dot com forward slash Cooper Club and you. Can How do you spell uh, Cooper Club? Uh, C double No. No K double K double P A C L U B. Fucking hell. <laughs> and um, on there, do you announce, like, how dyslexic you are? Yeah. Or did you just do that then? I just did it then. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm doing, just finishing an English degree as well, so that's worrying. Um, <laughs> yeah. I, I don't think coupe is in the Br- yeah. uh, English dictionary there. But yeah, it's it's the same thing where I think parents want the kids <sighs> to, be, to be safe online. Like, what made me laugh is, Annie was like, I don't understand this. She was like, I want to be able to talk to him, and she was like kicking off, and she was like, "I won't say anything bad," and then she died, and she was like, "Ah, oh, fuck!" And I was like, "That's why," <laughs> you know what I mean? In the heat of the moment, I, ind- I understand both sides of the story. Yes, I understand so do I. why so people do I. like every other company lets you do it, why can't I do it? And then I understand the fact of Nintendo going, "No, we we don't want bad news written about us." Exactly, we're in the next. Apart from our sales. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> but I think I, I don't see why you can't talk with your friends. If they're a Wii because U friend, again, you should be able to talk You've just said to why, them. because you can go ask me knobhead at 12 o'clock. Yeah, that's true, yeah. Yeah, that is true. But I suppose they need to find some medium, I think, between them two. Where maybe if you can connect know, with eight it, people I think, and go on it and talk to each other. Yeah, it works as with a ask me knobhead at 12 yeah, o'clock. Yeah. But at the same time, it... Um, it's kind of cool that nobody knows anything you know, because yeah. it's a team sport, but at the same time, it's every man for themselves. It's very unique in that in that aspect. Well, there was a really cool moment, actually, that um, I got really excited over because it's something that there was no communication, but all three of us knew what was going on at one point. Just where, a symbiotic relationship. Yeah, it was weird. Where we kind of all together, like, squidded up this wall and then was waiting on this platform and then the rest of the team came in, and then just all three of us, just at the same time, jumped in the air and just landed on this team and splattered them all mm. at once. And I was like, that was without us even talking. Like, all three of us knew that was waiting like, for like that I moment. Like I say, I think and, it gives a unique gameplay experience. Yeah. Because like I say, you're all on the same team, but it's every man for himself at the same time. Yeah. That's, that's cool. Yeah, that is true. It, it's just sometimes where I'm like, ah, oh, I want to speak to that person and tell what them what... What they could I'm... do is, they could, they could have um, an over-18s lounge. Yeah, that would work. Where it's like, right, you're confirming you're over eighteen. Yeah, yeah. Go wild. That would that would be good. Yeah, that that would work. Well. And oh. it can be because I think there's parental lock on the Wii U. Well, I was going to say if whatever, the parental like, locks on the Wii U, then you can't talk. But then there again, then the kids are just going to get splatted to hell by the yeah, adults. Next, then allowed on that lounge. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. It's only the adults only yeah. lounge. Is top, no, but that would... but at the same time, I do, again, I don't feel it. it it gives a unique aspect mm. in, in that sense. I, mm. I kind of like the fact it's all for yourself. and yeah. One for all and all for you, but not. Yeah. I just wish that you could do co-op online. Mm. You know, where I was like, you know, I'd, I'd like to do that at some point. But I don't know, this is all stuff you see that Splatoon is like an ever-changing thing anyway. Like, you don't know, they could announce something next week that would change the game. Like, yeah. it seems like they're learning as they go along as well which has been a really refreshing thing to see. And the m- more refreshing thing is, everything works. Mm. Day yeah, one, yeah, yeah. everything worked. I went straight on, played a good like 20 matches. I wonder how, ma- how many tweets you had to make after that test thing. Oh, the when test it, yeah. Launch, whatever it was called. Yeah, probably because quite a lot. Oh, mind you, but it all worked, didn't it? No, no, there was a massive fuck oh, up on, on the last one. Oh, okay. oh, oh, and it oh, went out it? for an hour. Oh, did it? Yeah. All right, I'll take that back. But yeah, they they got it right day one, and that's the most important thing. And the majority of the people that have played that game have not had a glitch. I mean, there's sometimes the most annoying thing is when someone quits out a game, which you can't actually quit out. You'd have to turn your Wii U off. So you'd have to be that angry that you turn your Wii U off. And when someone quits out a game, like it's team of four, so with one mm. person missing. Like I was saying, I was I was playing with Annie, and all three of the team quit out, and there was just hair. Right, and you just saw on the map like hair stood, and all this ink just filled the map coming towards there's, us from there's four no different. There's no real prevention or anything. <laughs> no, there ain't no. It, it was funny to watch that because she was like, "What do I do?" And I was like, Are "You just gonna have to take your medicine." And like, mm. you just saw like the four corners of the map closing in on her, and I just kind of stood in the middle of this little gun. Um, but uh, there's been a lot of moments where we've just like proper laughed at the game and like really funny little things where like um you'll do something really cool like you can turn into like a giant it's called the kraken and be like a giant squid and you can like squid around and like take everyone out it's like one of your power-ups and stuff and right so final question go on because was yeah <laughs> um is this was the big question i was okay, working up to ask did you see my evolution like, yeah yeah, so, yeah. Tr- hiking up that yeah it mountain. built like a like a like the pressure of a volcano Oh, yeah, it's no, a, it's, and it's about to rumble. It's going to, whoa, 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 explode. Yeah. Like Etna in your face. Yeah. Right, so... Like the smiler. Yeah. Um, I forgot what it was now. Oh, yeah. Will this game mm-hmm. hold up along this barrage <laughs> of summer blockbusters? Against Batman, against Fallout, no, which is coming out no, this no, year. No, no, again, no, 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 no. Will, will will it be able to hold its own? Will it be able to carry on? Will it be able to have a thriving community uh, when all these huge games are coming out? It'll do its own thing. Like, it's one of them games that you play... Yeah, but... Like... The Wii U's doing Wii U its, its own, own thing. thing. Yeah. 
but it'll be one of those games that like good. you'll get Batman and you'll play that Jeffrey Dahmer did his own thing yeah. <laughs> but sort of zombifying people and eating them not the best <laughs> um, but, <laughs> but like you'll play the new Batman game for five hours and yeah. then you'll go on Splatoon for half an hour like it, I think it'll be that yeah but I mean we'll like there constantly be people in lobbies and I think they will yeah, yeah. I think they will especially Japanese people I every time you go on it 90% of the people on it are Japanese on a Sunday they're all down the fish market <laughs> but will every every um, I think Nintendo are doing a smart thing here because yeah. they know that yeah they do or yeah. you would like to think that they know that <laughs> and the way that they're going to prevent that is every couple of months it's a new bit of content yeah that's it and, and, it's, and everyone's going for okay that cool day. And yeah. they, they're going to play it for for a month because they get back in. And then two a, a month after that, they're going, oh, it's now Amoeba Spot. Here's this, here's yeah, that. Yeah. Here's a new map. Here's this. Yeah. And I think that's the smart way with a game like this. When, yeah. you, when you're competing against Batman, you're competing against Halo. The, yeah. Like this Christmas, you're competing against Tomb Raider. You're competing against the next Call of Duty, yeah. the next fucking Assassin's Creed. Every big, huge game that's coming out. I mean, the Amoeba Support stuff's pretty good. And um, they've got already. But I, I know what you mean. But I mean, like... The three Amiibos that came out, by the way, look awesome. But yeah, yeah. the way they kind of work with it is there's, like, extra challenges and stuff. Like, there's 20 extra levels per Amiibo. And I thought, I was thinking when I played it, I was like, if they, this game came with those, like, 60 challenges or whatever, that would be that would have been a good amount of content. Do you know what I mean? Without mm. that kind of paywall of having to buy all three Amiibos. Yeah, seriously. Like, that would have been a, a fleshed-out game, if you know what I mean. So that's... My one criticism was that it wasn't fleshed out enough at the very, very beginning. But I think the majority of people don't buy that game at the, um, on launch. You know, people buy that game later on. It might it might get an extra boost at Christmas or, or whatever. I just thought of something. Go on. And I've thought of this th- three times now, Phil, the thing, and I was like, oh, I'll mention that when he's finished talking. Yeah, yeah. Um, they did a nice thing, whereas if you did the test launch, you got a discount on the digital version. Oh, yeah. I, like yeah, I saw that. that. Yeah, that, that was, was good. good. And it hasn't been too expensive to buy either in shops no, and stuff. I, I like, like that. And gone. I, I keep I, my brain kept going. Remember that. I got it for I got it for under thirty quid from Amazon, and then because the price of it changed that's good. day that's one, they refunded me twenty p because it went down by twenty p. That's good. Yeah. Um, I love Amazon. I love Amazon. I fucking they're still so honest with stuff like that. Yeah. Whereas like, I really don't care. I don't need that twenty p. But they're like, no, we're giving it to you. Um, I'd love to just fucking. Like if if Amazon was a woman, I'd anal analingus that. Because I think if think place. if Amazon was a, was a woman, she she won't be like a dirty whorish woman. Well, she would when I finish with her. Well, she'd have that side to her, wouldn't she? But she'd also she'd be she'd be she'd be everything. Like she'd be there when she you want, need I'd her. I'd just she'd... be like fucking. Here's yeah. your fucking prime. <laughs> oh God. Oof. You know what I mean? Yeah. Next day delivery. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking one day delivery. That'd be the problem though, that that'd be how quick they had kids. So you'd, nah, you'd put that you you'd 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 do that, you'd have sex and then the next day. Yeah, but they've got great customers. They've got great customer service. Say that kid, I want a refund. Yeah, that's true. And they just, just put it back in. Stick an old coat hanger up there and pop it out. <laughs> do it like the Victorians. Yeah. Um do it like a uh, fatty R buckle. Mm. Um so yeah, like overall impression, good game. Mm. It's a really good game. It's mm. fun. It's easy to pick up and play. It's cheap to buy reasonably, and there's a lot of content. Plus, there's the whole like single player campaign stuff. So there's a lot to do. There's a real lot to do. I focus mainly though on just the multiplayer because mm-hmm. I I can't um, stop playing it. But if you're if you aren't on there yet, add me. I'm PC seven three three four on my Wii U. You um, sound like a robot cop. And that's me, PC seven three three. PC seven three three three. Get on that. For duty. And um, I'll play you at some point. I've I've pretty much played everyone. I've played people like old favourites, like Galen. I don't actually. <laughs> the Galen. old favourites. The, the old classics. <laughs> and there's been a few old classics <laughs> on there. I'm Papa. Oh, I meant to say as well. Like I'm Mickey Mouse. And old I had this too. moment, and I don't know whether Nintendo noticed as well. I was playing against Nintendo, and every time. Like, I saw him. We just, like, suicided into each other with our splat roller. And, like, if you do that, you like you just both blow up together. And it really made me laugh because in one match, like, every time I saw Nintendo, I was just like, Nintendo! And you could see him, like, gab! And we just were like, poof! And we did it, like, three times. But I didn't know whether that was intentional or not. If it was, then it was pretty cool. If not, it's weird. But... 
Yeah, so I basically wanted you to kind consummated of that. your marriage. Yeah. I wanted to kind of mention that because it was, it was a moment where I was like, oh, I need to tweet about that to Nintendo and then I forgot. So I thought I'll bring it up on this, but well, that was really a really funny moment. If people want to tweet us, they can do that at Nintendo Sushi. Add us, tweet us, fucking messages, do what you want. Yeah. Uh, and join that Cooper Club that Gabe was on about earlier because that sounded really good. It is good. It is good. Am I a good actor? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah Fantastic. Yeah, yeah. Oscar, please. Because it's filmed. Yeah, it is, yeah. But so it's not really could, a film, is it? It's you more could like nominate this a, podcast for an op- uh, for an Oscar. Oh, or like a BAFTA. Yeah. Because yeah, we're you British. Could. Yeah. Young and upcoming yeah. filmmakers. That's it. BAFTAs. Yeah. Fish Ice, it's got all the camera like yeah. camera coolness. If they want jerks, we can do all that. BAFTA yeah. the future. They can use that as their advertising campaign. Yeah, yeah, they could, yeah. Yeah. Right. Oh, what's him with the dreadful? Oh, don't worry about him. He's just a Baftafarian. We've got, we've got loads That's of good. jokes. Yeah, yeah. That famous film with Will Smith in Bafta Air. Yeah. And uh, uh, who, who's the year? Uh, to give this award. Bafta La Vista, <laughs> baby. Loads of them. Yeah. yeah. Right. I can't think of any more. <laughs> I, I, I can do this all day. <laughs> yeah. Right, so um, we'll see you. We'll see you. Bafta the future. Yeah. Bafta, you get back. Yeah, from after I get back from my shows. Yeah. <laughs> and after you get come back from Baf- Afghanistan. Afghanistan. <laughs> right, see you later. Alligator. Love you all. Keep Dirt. tall. Dirt. Talk to strangers. Bye. <laughs>